Hey guys, in return to uh, more uh, Pokemon Soul Silver, in last episode we got more through the this uh, area, and here we go. It's me, Giovanni, the majestic Giovanni himself. Wahahaha! Huh? I don't sound anything like Giovanni. I don't even look like Giovanni. How come? I worked so hard on this mimic to make it mimic him. And yes, it's Patrell. It's our uh, first time fighting Patrell, and he is not hard at all. I'm not even kidding you. He is probably the easiest, like, wimp out there. He's terrible. If you can't beat him, I feel very sorry for you. I mean, who makes this guy a freaking administ- like a goddamn uh, manager of Team Rocket, one of them, or one of the uh, admins of Team Rocket? It's pathetic. I mean, I feel bad for their team. Let's look at this. I'll, I'm going to sweep him. I'm just going to sweep him. But later on, he gets a little tough. Like, it probably, it's not, it's not even as hard. It's probably as hard as this, because we're talking about the same, like, a little bit higher levels. But he's not hard at all. So don't worry about him. I don't, I don't know if you guys know this, but, um, Giovanni is, oh, well, uh, Silver? G that's Giovanni. Uh, Silver's dad is Giovanni. I thought it was pretty cool. I always thought Red, well, that, that was Giovanni. Red, uh, Giovanni was Red's uh, dad. For some reason, for some odd reason, I always thought that it was. But it's not, so. Never know. I think I might do some more events later on. I like the ones that you might, well, I, I know for sure Pokemon White, we're gonna have an event right off the bat to get Pokemon Zero. I don't know its name, and hopefully, hopefully, I know what moves I'm, like, teaching my Pokemon, because it's going to suck if I don't. <clears throat> I think Cypokies or Cerebi.net will have it. Yeah, that's right, Patrol, you better run into that wall, you stupid. Keep running. Yes, my marker opens over here and says, Hail, Hail Giovanni. And, yes, we had to chase this little sucker all the way out. It is not fun. And, uh, if we go up here, I think this is an item. Thief. Uh, either, I think they did the same thing. Snatch and Thief did the same thing. I'm unaware, though. Let's go ahead up here. Oh, my back is killing me. It's gonna do something. The password held Giovanni. And it's gonna be hit over here again. Go down these stairs. And say it again. So it goes down there. Okay. Now let's go ahead and switch out to for alligator. Cause uh I need to do I need to have a strong Pokemon to defeat these uh, guys. Here's an item. A full heal that we completely missed. I just keep following him. Okay, thank gosh we. Oh, duh. Go in here, I think. I'm not sure. Yep, that was right. And keep on following it. And we're here. The marker was Hail Giovanni. The wish ignition unlocked it. Then the stupid bird runs away. And look who we meet. Ariana. She is probably one of the coolest ones, but there's another guy, my favorite, that I like coming up soon. Hold it! A two on two battle! Let's do this! Giovanni, I'll show you what the metal, what us uh, Team Rockets do. The little metal people, meddling people. I don't know what you said. Ariana versus Team Rocket Grunt. Executive. Okay, I like how the fact that his Dragonite's only level 40, and he's the freaking champion. But, uh, eh, you know, he's a champion. He'll probably train his Pokemon by the time we go against him. So, no worries. Dragonite, you still need me battle, let me fight him. Whatever. And then, freaking, the Grunt has his almost the same level as a regular executive. I think they made this game a little too easy. I mean, I didn't see... Well, I mean, it would probably be a challenge for people that just started Gold and Silver that never, ever played uh, Gold and Silver. 
I can see it being a challenge, nor crystal, if they never played gold, silver, or crystal. I can see it being a challenge, but just to me, it's not really a challenge, because I've already beaten gold and silver and crystal probably like twice, so. That was silver, Pokemon Silver was my first, no, blue, no, yeah, silver was my first ever game. Then I owned all the blue, I owned blue and red, I've owned every single Pokemon game, but yeah, it was kind of funny, because I was born when blue was made, so, uh, no, I wasn't. It, I was uh, a kid like when I got uh, silver, and then I got blue after. My dad used to have them all, and he gave them to me. So, yeah. you got to be kidding me. How about you guys tell me this? What was your first ever Pokemon game? You guys go ahead and tell me that down in the uh, comments. Your first ever Pokemon game. I think that's how one won. He said his was blue. So I guarantee if he watches this video, if he watches this video, he's gonna put my first ever game was blue. Ah, oh, Dragonite. Let us hit it. Uh, that was really pointless, Gloom. Really pointless. <sighs> Pop my back. That felt good. Come on. And death. Also, uh, I have another question. What's your favorite Pokemon ever? Uh, put it down in the comments so I can know. That'd be pretty cool to know. Mine is uh, Cyndaquil, Quillov, and Typhlosion. I know I didn't pick them for this, but I've always, always picked Cyndaquil, so I was, I, I've always wanted to try uh, Totodile. So. Yep, and so far it's going good. Alright. We have much bigger plans. You'll come to appreciate Team Rocket's true power soon enough. Enjoy yourself while you can. <laughs> Why did Lance move all the way over there? And I moved up here. Whatever. Alright, so... Now we have to, uh... You'll see in a second. He'll tell you. It's a machine that's causing all the problems. I don't see a switch on it. I, we have no choice. We have to make all the electrode faint. That should stop this machine from transmitting the strange signal. It's no fault for the electrode. Trevor, let's split the job. Um, I think I'm gonna end the video here because I don't want it to run over. So in the next episode of Pokemon Soul Silver, we're gonna go ahead and defeat the electrode and uh, get ready for the uh, seventh gym. See you guys then.